Oh, oh and he goes down here in the first. Ruthless, the Romano Duno oh. has tagged. Noong March 3, taong 2017, nang harapin ng ating 21 years old na bagitong kababayan na si Romero Duno, ang knockout artist na pangbato ng Amerika at Golden Boy promotion na si Christian Gonzalez sa kanilang baluarte sa Los Angeles Velasco Theater. May undefeated record ito na 16 wins, walang talo, labing apat dito ay tinapos by a knockout. Maituturing talaga na knockout artist ang kalaban ni Duno. Right uppercut, left hook, it's over. I thought tonight, guys. Isa din ito sa prospect at pangbato ng Golden Boy promotion. Pero sinira ni Duno ang pangarap ni De La Hoya para sa kanyang bata. Nang sandali ang talunin ng ating kababayan ang kanilang pangbato. Ang ating kababayan nga po mga idol ay may record na 12 wins, isang talo at labing isa po dito ay tinapos ni Romero Duno by knockout ng panahon na ito. Sadyang may dala ding lakas si Romero Duno kaya kahit undefeated ang kanyang kalaban, kumpiyansa si Duno na kaya nitong manalo sa laban. Hindi nga po tumagal ang kanilang laban para sa vacant WBC Youth Intercontinental Lightweight Belt. Pinabagsak po kasi ito agad ni Romero Duno sa unang round gamit ang solidong kanan sa huling 20 seconds ng round 1. Oh! And he goes down here in the first! Ruthless! Romero Duno has tagged! At tinapos ang laban sa loob lang ng round 2 gamit ulit ang solidong right cross. Again! Oh! his opponent. Let's see how that affects him here for the next 30-40 minutes. We are ready to go. Our main event, eight rounds in the lightweight Taylor. Guys, belt line's good here. Belt line's a little hot, coach. Belt line's a little hot. I'm gonna let him work in here, all right? Ang ganda nga mga idol ng simula ng laban dahil bigayan talaga ang dalawang knockout artist matira matibay mga idol. Sa round 1 pa lang ay bumagsak agad ang kalaban. Talagang solid nga po ang tumamang suntok ni Duno kay Gonzales. Bagsak ang undefeated prospect. Ngunit ang ating kababayan ay hindi na nasurpresa sa kanyang ginawa na parang inaasahan na niyang mapapabagsak niya talaga ang kanyang kalaban. Beto, I think early on this is exactly where Chimpo wants to be. If he's going to be able to establish that jab, I think he'll be content to actually move outside a little bit. But if he can get in close, he's one of those taller fighters, Jason. Despite his build, they seem to be more comfortable inside than on the perimeter. Boxing very well right now. He's establishing a jab, which I said earlier on, I think is key in any fight. You know, I think his punches are definitely looking stronger and more effective than these punches right now. This is Ruthless Romero Duno. Du Ruthless because of his style, he just comes at you. We saw that clip of him fighting in the mall in the Philippines. Ooh. He will stand there with you. And you know what the problem is right now? He's standing in with Chimpo, who I just really thought landed a very good looking left hook.
Some would say you're better off that way. But Jason, I think moving on, I know one thing Chimpa seems to believe that he's a stronger puncher. I think one mistake he can't make is to continue inside without at least throwing that jab in front of him. Sa pagbagsak na po ng kalaban, ay tumingin at tumakbo na lang ito sa corner habang nag-aantay ng bilang ng referee. Oh! And he goes down here in the first! Nang makatayo na si Chimpa Gonzalez at magbigay ng hudyat ang referee, agad itong pinaulan ng suntok ng ating kababayan. Ngunit na saved by the bill niya ito mga brother. Pero dito po sa round 2 mga idol, ang solid na kanan ni Romero Duno ang tumama sa mukha ni Gonzalez at tuluyan nang natapos ang laban. Makikita rin dito mga idol na hindi na po talaga kaya ni Chimpa Gonzalez na magpatuloy pa kaya ay nihinto na po ng referee ang laban. Ngunit sa kasama ang palag mga idol, masama nga po ang naging tama ng undefeated prospect sa lakas po ng kanang suntok ni Romero Duno na sinalo ni Chimpa Gonzalez. You know, I, I'll be honest with you, I think Chip early on had success and he, I think he fell into the trap, Jason, of believing he was just going to be able to walk through this guy. And I think both Makikita nga po mga idol na isinakay ang kalaban ni Romero Duno sa isang stretcher paglabas ng ring. Nakuha nga po ng ating kababayan ang titulong WBC Youth Intercontinental Lightweight title. Hanggang dito na lang po muna tayo mga idol. Kung nagustuhan nyo ang ating video ay pakilike and subscribe po bilang suporta. At pindutin nyo na din ang notification bell button para updated ka sa mas kaabang-abang na bakbakan. Muli, Joey Boy TV nga pala at maraming salamat po.